Hello gamers, my name is Kitchen, and this is Canary in a Crater, a game about asteroid mining in a 2D environment, which I kind of like that, that kind of thing. I don't really know about this game, it looks really, really new and like maybe a little bit underdeveloped, but uh, I've been given a preview key to show you the game today by Iron Moose Development. This is their flagship title, so I'm very excited to see what they've done here. Uh, we will just load a new asteroid. I've, I've done no play at all in this game. This is all we saw on the front screen. There's apparently a little intro cinematic. I'm told these asteroids can be dangerous. I'm also told they can be profitable. Hmm. Sounds about right. Let's dig. I will say from what I've seen of the like trailers, it looks kind of interesting. They don't show too much or like how it really works. But here we are. Smooth landing. Great. Now get busy. He's got an eye patch over his helmet. Alright. Use WASD and space to move. E to interact. So we can jump. Look at him flip. Uh, e to interact. But it doesn't really do anything. Oh yeah, here. Asteroid scan. Interesting. Let you, your shuttle lets you save your progress. And so it's quite, kind of important, I guess. Yeah. Also be sure to check the asteroid scanner. It can reveal caves and tech crystals. Uh -huh. Alright, so asteroid scan. And so then you sort of scan your asteroid. Uh, and I suppose we. It looks like we want to get to these areas and probably this thing there, right? Uh huh. Back. Uh, we can uh, save image. Sure. Didn't really do anything. Okay. Oh, we have something over here. What is this? Select an item to purchase. Here's where you'll be stocking up on supplies and selling the ores you find in the ground. Be sure to keep your battery charged and save up for valuable upgrades. Keep my battery charged. Alright, not much of a tutorial either. But it looks like my battery is up here. So, how do we dig? Your detect ore just activated. It can reveal ores and dangers hidden underground. Try and find some acnium. It's uh, common on the surface on, of these asteroids. Your laser drill should make short work of it. Aim with WSD and then hold left shift to drill. All right, I think this is a really important point to make and this is kind of what I gravitate towards in the trailer anyway. As soon as we go underground here, it'll activate, but we can only like, we only have a short view range, not unlike, not like many other of these digging games where you can just like spot into the ore far ahead and see everything around you here you have to sort of walk up to things and be like ah and scan the ground so let's try mining this out and see what happens we got alternate great you just picked up a valuable ore bring it back to the shop to sell oh i should warn you it's easy to get stuck if you're not careful stuck up on ladders in the shop you can, they can save you i see yes so it, we can't apparently just climb we could probably end up getting stuck like he said what's this here then Acnium. All right, so the, this was Acnium. The other thing was not Acnium, something else. And I can see we're running out of battery fairly quickly. I wonder what this in here is. Oh, we can't dig into that. Uh, but we are using battery doing this. Interesting. I wonder what this here is. We have three out of five ores carrying in our bag, I think. So let's go and try to sell it. Oh, my ship is saying something. Oh, I think the the, the the lighter area here is probably just what we saw as like, now we see that this has changed, this is what I've been digging out. So this means that like this holes, but below this big hole then or cave or whatever it is, there's a, a little yellow thingy that we will want to try to get to. So we're coming up here. We, oh, we buy battery. Oh boy, we have to pay for that. Ladder, placeable, stackable ladders that enable an escape to any holes you may find yourself in. Buy for 15. 
Yeesh, baby. Great, great. Now you can press Q to rotate your health item. Press E to place the item hilt. Alright, we sell all. We got 120 here just for that. Not too shabby. We can buy a battery. Detect or charge. Recharge. Recharge your ore sensor. Oh, okay. That's not like a resource that we carry around. I see. So let's go and scan this area over here. See if... Oh, and it's, it uses battery as soon as it starts scanning. Not only when I do stuff, but continually. Scary. Oh, we got more down there. All right. I'm trying to jump over here, though. Yeah, that worked. Ah, we got stuff here. Okay. Anything up here? No. We saw more ore, like, way down below. So, let's see if we can get to that. Your bag seems to be full. You won't be able to dig any more ores. Yeah. So, Q. Aha, and in E. Yes. Now we can... Roll up. Come over here. Well, I don't want to use too many of them. So, E here, sell. 150 for this. Alright, we've made progress. Now we know how to work this, I think. We just go down. I don't know what happens if we run out of battery. Hopefully we don't just die, but we'll see. I'm going to try to run out of battery just to find out, I suppose. Um, I think I saw some down here. Yeah. Good stuff. Or tonight. Let's go this way. Go backpack full, then we may we'll make the trip back. Oh look at that, the uh, center scanning range goes gets smaller and smaller when we have less battery. I get it now. Okay, so we have to buy the battery, I think, here. We will sell, sell all, we will buy some more ladders. What else do we have here? Drill upgrade. You can upgrade the power of your laser drill. We have a hard 397 here. Detect or upgrade one. Improve the radius and battery capacity of your patented detector. See, now that seems really, really useful. Backpack upgrade, of course, also useful. Uh-huh. Yeah, let's start with the detect or upgrade. Uh, then it gets more expensive, but we could upgrade the bag. Oh. The price of the charge has changed. I don't know if it was bigger or smaller than... If oh, I think it might be relative to how much we're missing. I see. It's not like a, a fixed price. Always pay a certain amount to fill your thing, because then I would always want to empty it. No, 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 it's just, it's relative to how much charge you're actually missing. Uh, I want to buy some letters to... Did I click or did I not? We only have eight. Ah, but we have multiple layers. So I'm clicking, I'm clicking, so we have two extra. Okay. I think we can get away with buying a drill upgrade here. So let's go, and now we should have more detection range. Uh, but I see nothing in here. Okay. So now we're digging blindly, I suppose. I think it makes sense to kind of do a stair type of situation. Uh, so we don't have to pay for um, that many ladders. I suppose then we're not... If we're digging straight down, we make better time. Hmm, and there's the cave... I don't know, maybe we maybe we do the, the stair type. I, I want to get to that cave anyway. So then I think the stair situation makes good sense. I guess we're going in here. Oh, and then what if up? What if up? We can dig up. Oh! Oh, and that thing fell down. Oh. That was, that's what these things mean, I suppose. And here I want to get up there. So I will put an E in order to get here. Aha. Backpack full. All right, so then we got to get back up. And over here it's going to have to be with ladders, which is fine. And I think... Oh, I see something in here. Nice. Uh, let me... 
dig down there then. So I don't miss it coming back. Here. Alright, a successful trip. We didn't upgrade the backpack, I suppose. So sell, sell, buy. So now it's 24 to charge. That's not super expensive. So we can get away, I think, with buying the back upgrade. Sounds good to me. Alright, and already we're seeing how this game is going to play out. I kind of, I, I really enjoy these types of games. I've played a lot of them. This is not the prettiest one I've seen, but this mechanic with the fog of war or whatever you want to call it. I like that as a concept anyway. I'm going to dig down here. And then I'm just going to make a path over to the ladder from here. Then I don't know. We could end up getting stuck into inside this cave here, I think. Oh no. Oh, wow. Oh, and there's falling damage, by the way. Respawn. Keep an eye out. You might start seeing more valuable ores at this depth. <laughs> Respawning is an uncomfortable process, but it sure beats the alternative. Uh, I'm not sure if we lost anything in respawning. I'm sure we must have. I didn't notice. And I didn't know we could die. So we've learned... Learned stuff. Alright. Let that not be... A stopping point for us. Uh, so we are not dropping... I thought we could just drop down here maybe even to save time. But no, 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 no. Um, <laughs> I guess if we dive, then I'll see if we get punished. I saw that there's resources up in the ceiling. Over here. Q. Oh, we lost the stairs, the ladders. Oh no, we can't get up then. Are you kidding me? Oh, yeah, I'm pressing Q and we're not getting any ladders. Wow. So how do we die? Can I like kill myself here, yeah, respawn? We have 97. You will lose all items by respawning, are you sure? All right, so then we didn't lose anything this time because we didn't have any items available. Bye, bye, bye. No point, nothing to sell. Uh, recharge the battery, of course. Okay. Rough start, but... Uh, let me see real quick before we go down again. If the ship has anything new to show me. Asteroid scan. We can, we can see now that we've made it to the second cave. Or the first cave. Uh, and... Hmm, save image. I wonder... I can spot some more resources over here now. Now that we have a bigger scan range, the answer is yes. Q, E, what do we have in there? Malachite? I think Malachite is green. With the rye. Alright, go and sell that. Oh, that takes up four slots in my backpack for that one mining. That's why we filled up our backpack so quickly before. I didn't really notice that. I see. Another thing learned. Not everything takes up just one space. So do we want to drop down into this cave? I think I think it's okay. We have to come back up eventually. But there's also stuff in the ceiling, so I think that's fine. This thing over here. Auto night. Oh, we got a mother load. All right, backpack is full, and we can't even get up here. I think so. This is, and then another E here, and then I think we we go up. Uh, yeah. Mm. No, let's go up here. Oh, that made that thing fall. Interesting. Mm. Another backpack upgrade would be pertinent, I think. And I'm realizing just now, I don't think I mentioned, but this game is not out yet. So this is a preview build. 
and uh, it'll be I don't even know when it gets it becomes available this tech is not oh so we have to find tech stuff all right but that's just digging deeper we saw that yellow spot on on the scanner so that's probably what we're looking for interesting so let's try to get to that in this episode and see if I can learn of a new tech for you guys just to see like a bit of what we are getting it towards backpack is full really either I didn't really empty my backpack or that whole thing was just one mother load of of a resource of course we're going back up pretty sure I clicked sell out all before so I guess I didn't. We can buy detector upgrade, detector upgrade two. I think I will. That seems like a powerful thing, being able to scan further. We can better see if we are missing some resources out in the darkness. Now I wonder how would we get if I go like and then sideways, then up go over like this we know that there's stuff in the ceiling here oh and we see something up there uh, this is gonna make me fall so if I put a stair here yep that worked okay not sure if that was worth it for that one bit but it was three three of that autonite in one load Then we're going further down, and now I want to... Oh, okay, let's go direct, I suppose, to get to this thing. Then make the stair again to get to this other cave. And we see some more resources. Nice. Battery has a lot more lifetime now. I like that. Here's some stuff. And there's the tech thing, I think. Here's a new resource. Seems like something we would want to bring up. We're probably going to make one more trip up before we uh, get to the tech here. Yes, we're making a stair here. A ladder, I mean. Maybe we can get to the tech now. Kind of looks like we might as well do it. Let's find out what this thing is about. Ah, wonderful. A tech crystal. Come check the shop. You can buy rope ladders. Oh, all right. Be some quality of life stuff in that. And we have 10 more letters, so we'll be fine. Oh, we can't dig through this thing, right? I thought I could make a shortcut. There might be some merit in actually making a better path up. All right, so first of all, charge the battery. Then we got rope ladder. Creates a rope ladder that extends up to 15 meters. Stack of ladders that enable an escape to any holes you may find yourself in. It stands up to 15 meters. I don't know. I suppose we'll buy it. Then we will sell all. Now worth to note that my backpack has still has stuff, has stuff in it. Interestingly enough, I think the rope ladder took up two spaces in the backpack and it costs 50 that seems really really expensive so I'm not really sure if this this doesn't feel like it was worth it but maybe I'm wrong we should have checked the scanner I suppose before we went back down Any 
anything over here. Not all. Oh, here we go. Hmm. How many normal letters? We have 10 normal letters. So let me do a thing. We'll dig down here. Be like. <clears throat> uh, now I want to get back up. So a rope ladder, will it help me? Yeah, I see. I think I used this wrong. And this may have been obvious. But I wasn't sure. Because how will we... So it only drops down, of course. This is what we're seeing. Probably a long... Uh, I should have put it like up here and then dropped it down. But then... Seems like a really weird ladder type. And if we get 10 letters with the other letter type for one purchase, for 15 instead of 50 for that one, then I'm not so sure I like the rope ladder at all. There may be a use to it that I'm just not seeing right now. And by that I mean there's almost certainly a use to it that I'm not seeing. Guess we're going over here. Woohoo! Oh, we might be running out of ladders here. Yeah, I don't have any more ladders, so I think it's time we go back up. But we're not really full up on resources or anything. We have plenty of money, so it's not like a big deal. And I do feel like I should check this scanner in the ship. Music is nice. Okay, we got all the way up. I think I see a, a use for the rope ladder just now. And uh, maybe I can demonstrate. Let's check this asteroid scanner now. Uh, can we go deeper? We've been all the way down here, but it seems like it doesn't scan deeper than this. <clears throat> All right, so let me see if I can plan this out. Asteroid scan. Yeah, if we dock straight down here, we would hit this cave. And then next time we come back up, we will buy a rope ladder and then drop that here and have a rope ladder access direct down for the future trips, right? Also get to scan a whole new area here. Stuff is happening. It's not allowing me to do this. Okay. I need to go get a little bit in. Like this. Oh. Then we see resources, of course. And then I divert my attention. Hmm. But I want to go over this way. And this is to get a faster path down. Maybe also a faster path up. Again, I see a resource. And we have to divert our attention. But maybe this is a fine enough path to just make this one long corridor. Except now my backpack is full. And we are nowhere near where I want it to be. I don't know what happens if I mine this and don't have the backpack full yet. I'll get punished. Okay. Let me see if this theory works out. Not, not if we go through other resources here. Because obviously we lost money now, and that's terrible. And I didn't buy normal ladders, so if I can't find that other cave, we can't get back up now. Fun. My, path, my point is to make one big shaft. And then we will use the other path up, drop a rope ladder down. And then hopefully... We will have a faster route to our destination. Here we are finding that cave. Now I'm worried that I'll drop into the cave and die, but it looks like I'm hitting just the edge of it, which is perfect. Yes. Yeah, couldn't have been better. Could not have been better. So let me see. Now we go back up. Let's 
this is a little tedious doing all this jumping sideways stuff here. Of course, not be paying a lot of money to make that extra shaft, but if, if it's in the interest of saving time, that's important for the battery charge. For one thing, and also yeah, for my time, of course. And we did find new resources, so we made money doing it. I think it's fine. And good. Sell 450, sweet. Buy first batteries, then something is still filling in my ladder. That would be the stairs or the ladders. Something is filling in my backpack, that's what I meant to say, I suppose. Back upgrade, detector, drill upgrade. Hmm. For 350, yeah. But let me buy 15 meters. One more. Drill upgrade. I hope three is enough. Now I'm worried here because I'm gonna go over the edge. But it totally worked. Oh, oh, I didn't, ah. I didn't press Q to in, uh, uh, equip the rope ladder. That's what happened there. I see, whoopsie. <laughs> what a misclick. That was silly. Anyway, now we can get up and down in, the, in this path. This. There's more here, I see. So then you do this. And uh, I think this shaft was the right call. Because now we, we're spotting some resources, we can like do side sideways paths in, in into the rock here easily. All right, let me see if I can do this just right. If I click here, nothing happens, so I have to go spam the E button. Yep. All right, uh, but I can't climb up. Interesting. So the way we remedy that. And this may be something that they could work on. So we have to bypass that connection between the two rope ladders. Interesting. All right. Oh, now we can climb all the way up. Huh, okay. Maybe I was just hitting like a bump before. And all in all, I think this rope ladder shaft is working out to our advantage. Backpack upgrade would be the next thing I would like to get. The fact that items also take up backpack slots is really tricky. I forgot to buy a battery. Could we run? No. Mm -hmm. Would be too easy, wouldn't it? Buy some more backpack charge. Let's do one more dig into this in this episode here, just to see how far we can go. Get some money. I suppose we didn't spot any more resources here. Nah. Here's some stuff. And I will use the rope ladder here. Okay, with the right. And this was in the fort. So now I wonder if I dig down here. Yeah, it doesn't. Ex oh, it does extend the rope ladder. Ah, then this is the way to use it, obviously. Then it's probably more money efficient. I've been instructed to warn you this asteroid belt has evidence of snail colonies. There's a chance that there aren't any on this rock, but you never know. Interesting, not sure what to take away from that. Probably an enemy type of some, uh, or a sort. Not sure if like we have to fight stuff. So far, I don't feel like I can fight stuff with this little mining laser, but maybe I'm wrong. Oh, you were flattened by a boulder. 
Uh, and I think that's an excellent way to end the episode. I hope everyone enjoyed it. This was like just a little first look at a, a, a game that is, is still in development very much. And But I think, I mean, you can probably have fun with this. I don't know how deep it will go. I would have liked to have some more tools already, but this may even be the limit of, of the the game. I don't know. I feel like we have pushed the scanner a little bit, so probably the deeper we go, the more we'll see. But, uh, oh, we have to save game here. Indeed. So thank you all for watching, and uh, this uh, first look of Canary Crater, right? <laughs> and I hope you enjoyed it. See you around, folks, and...